G'day guys here, we'll just take a look at either using the, the PDC or the DRC when we've got more heavy duty applications, might be running some bolts into a post and a, and a beam. So it's really important that you've got your settings correct. So this has got electronic torque shut off. So if you haven't got the right settings, it'll stop. So we'll, we'll go through that now. So we're just gonna run, run a hole through the post and beam. And here we've got our settings on top. So these ones here, we've got our four speed gearbox. So we're gonna drop that down to one for the highest torque. It's a slower speed, but it's a highest torque. And what's important here is that in between far left and far right, which is full torque, we've got our, our torque settings, which will shut out. So when we're doing something like this, we need to make sure that it's on the far left or far right drill mode. So what would happen if we didn't have that right in there is that the, the machine will shut off. So we'll start this where it'll cut out. Okay, and all that's saying is that the settings aren't right. So all I need to do on top here is to flick that out to its full torque mode. Then that'll drive straight into it. So that's when using, using the chuck. So this has got the fast fix chuck so we can disconnect that. The same thing goes for if we want to use Centratech. So it might be we want a lighter weight, we can put a bit in there. And we've got the tool holder with our, our bit straight into that. So exactly the same settings. Uh, because it's a screw, we might get away with something else, but we'll leave it on, on one for this. And then we can, we can pop the, a larger screw in there as well. So it's just a way of having that, you know what the electronic torque shutoff is, but also having the right settings on it for the application.